how to sell digital products on selfie hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial in today's video i'm going to show you how easy it is to create a store within selfie and also how you can list your products into uh, the store that you have created especially the digital products so all you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end then you are going to be good to go the first thing that you need to do is to head over to selfie.com and you are going to start your free trial so click on start free trial it will give you here a 14 day uh, free trial so we are going to see here at the platform when you click on it you're going to get this basically i have put the information about my account i have used a google account so here we are going to have three steps to set up the store the first step is what do you want to sell here it is going to be demanding from you what are you going to sell into your store so here we have digital downloads and streams or digital products we have digital subscription or uh, as you can say here subscriptions we have physical products print on demand products so in my case i will go ahead and select all of the four suggestions then we are going to click on next now the second step is going to be here uh, contributing to the categorization of the products so you're going to categorize here the products that you're going to sell basically we are going to have here some clothing accessories beauty and health uh, etc so i'm going to put something maybe like here we are going to set up the uh, clothing and accessories for example or art and craft so we are going to select this maybe click on next now we are going to see the store customization so we are going to put here the or select the theme color for example this that or whatever color that we have we have here simply five colors or these standard colors this is the generic one this is more modern this is a little bit a little bit bluish pinkish and greenish now we are going to put here the name of our store for example jack smith stores and we can upload a uh rather uh, the photo to be our logo so i'm going to upload a photo real quick so basically here we are going to see the logo now we have some short description as you can see and the final step is here to set up the social links like the instagram link TikTok and whatever uh, platform that you have. For example, we have Pinterest, we have uh, Telegram, Vimeo, we have a lot, Snapchat, YouTube, whatever. So you are going to put here the links for your socials and then you are going to put them apart. I'm going to add here Facebook only for the sake of the uh, icons, also X. And the final one is going to be maybe YouTube. Now what I'm going to do is to click on done. Here we have the design of the, uh, as you can see store. We're going to get here our dashboard. So we are going to wait for it. So basically here we are on the dashboard of the uh, store of our selfie. Now what are we going to see here is the uh, checklist to complete uh, right there to set up uh, the profile. So we are going to add here the first product and in case you have already a store we are going to head over the store here at the left side of the screen which is going to be here the control panel for our uh, things on the store you're going to select products here we are going to add the type of the product so basically we are going to add here a digital product we're going to select this upload ebooks music videos software or anything else digital so we're going to make sure that it is going to be visible on store page and here we are going to add the product files so we are going to have here a space uh, conceived to up to 50 files with a combined size of 10 gigs or fewer so here we have the product details like the uh, name of the product uh, as you can see also here we have the uh, product description uh we have the product category the preview of the product which is going to be here the uh, cover image for that or the media for the products we have the pricing and we have the stock which is going to be limited you can add some variants and this is a very good feature 
some custom field, SEO settings, and the save button. Now we are going to add or start adding a digital product. So let's say that we are going to add an ebook. So we are going to name that ebook something like, I don't know here. Uh, so I'm going to have here a title of an ebook that I have created already. So um, how to be a successful or how to be successful, for example, in life. I'm not an influencer, but this is just an example. Now for the description like that is an ebook for example that will for example help you help you to uh, get your life together together and by for example start thinking positively in in positively something like that and then you are going to put here whatever you want you can regulate here or put some editing to the text you can add some format some images in the description some uh, hyperlinks some HTML codes whatever then you are going to add here a new category for example ebook like that so the slug is going to be here uh for that or the slug that does mean the url or the last part of the url that you are going to put here it is going to be um seo related so we are going to give it here how to for example to be oh the category is going to be here uh the ebook so successful for example success for like that i'm going to click on save now the category is set you can add another or additional category here the product preview is going to have here images so we are going to add an image here we have added our image or our illustration for the product now we are going to put a price for that so we're going to set it up as maybe 29.99 uh, USD dollars or whatever currency that you want you only need to click on the drop down here or the arrow for the drop down menu select your uh, here currency from it and here we have it the stock is going to be unlimited either uh, for this or uh, the variants but if you want to make this product unique you can disable the unlimited and make a quantity for this product but here, most of the time people will not stop selling some uh, digital products uh, for the variance you can add some colors or whatever you want here for the type of variance you can name it put a price on it and etc here for the seo settings you're going to put a title tag to make uh, this uh, specific product or this digital product seo friendly so you can uh, add here for example uh, ebook or uh, ebook for example about getting a success for example life and money growth for example and etc description go ahead and have here a description you have a um, max size for 500 character and you can also add some social sharing images which will uh, be on social media and here we have it now for the uh, most important part is to add the product files like i have did here so i have added the uh the pdf file for this one it has been set up like this you can enable the pdf sampling uh, and etc to uh, protect the uh, product from being shared after purchase and here we have it now the thing that you need to do is to click on save product and here we have it so you can go ahead and view it in our store and also copy the link to share it uh, elsewhere here we have the file the size of file the price and etc and for this specific area you can go ahead and set up the um, store so as you can see here we have the store 
settings you can organize your store design it and customize it like this so you are going basically to customize your store by clicking on the button here and get it like this so you are going to face the store customizer uh here we have some problem with the editor but it is okay the objective of this video to put up here a digital file or a digital product is set up here to order and here we have it basically you are going to have also to connect a payment getaway so you are going to uh, get a payment getaway from here or put up the settings like setting up the things from here so you are going to connect stripe here here we have paypal and you're going to see the primary account currency and based like that so uh, basically that was the second thing and third thing which is going to be selecting the plan so here we have or you need to remember that this is a free trial you're going to get here to choose a plan to make sure that your store will be still alive but that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one